It's a shame I don't really do the tracker for it much anymore. If I could do some sort of automated thing. Ah, there probably is an automated way of doing it. Let's do the whole run. Okay. So. Do that, do that. Just wanted to see the makeout scene again, clearly. Okay, we do that, do that. We, we switch characters and then we uh, walk. Switch, 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 walk, 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 walk. And then we glide. To around here. And then... Okay, that one didn't count, unfortunately. I have to do one more because of that. Over there, a flow thread. Perfect. Although it's how many more you think? Ooh, that was an optimal like know. U turn. Three? Maybe four. Good thing there are plenty of flow threads around here. Is that useful? Tutorial. Yeah. yeah. One or two more threads, and we'll be all set. <laughs> Whoops. Try again. All right, I'm all charged up. Me too. Cool. Oh, nice. Nice. I'll take it. <laughs> See, that's what I meant. Like. This is clearly blessed run. Unfortunately, yeah, like, there's another tutorial section 20 minutes into this game. <laughs> Just because it expects you to go in and out of the haven a bunch. And because we uh, Do don't. Do we try and pick something else? Yeah, because we don't go in and out of the haven so much, it triggers that as, like, the second real exit on exploration we do. So. That's why the uh, next tutorial is 20 minutes in. <laughs> well, there is one tutorial we can skip actually, which is the um, aerial thread tutorial. It doesn't force you to do um, aerial threads. Mini flow also, um, they used to not force you to. Uh, they used to let you just roam freely and not kill. I, I, I'll talk about this later, actually. Because um, the the boss you have to, the, or the mini boss, shall we say, do you have to fight? That way. Look. Great. We can bring them back to the nest to stop. Yeah, like there's the first real fight, which is the oink fight where they kind of teach you how to fight properly. Then um, the second fight where you pick up the anti grav and the radar. Uh, that's where they teach you about combo attacks. Explain to me how you know which way north is on this planet. And they used to basically the the entrance to continue. Well, <laughs> Thank you. The exit to continue uh, used to be there. Now the exit to continue only uh, exists after you um, 
actually fight the boss. Mini boss. Not really a boss. We're here. We found the nest. Well. Cool. A A. This run is looking too promising. It's too promising. That's when you know it will go wrong. Okay. So this is the first like time you're really leaving the nest. Okay, north northwest. I think we've got everything we need to mold a joint for the track. So <laughs> then yeah, cool. That that was pretty much optimal. <laughs> so that makes me happy. <laughs> there was a slight bit of unoptimal um, bit right there where I didn't fast forward some of the dialogue for a little bit this of time. Is also full of rust. But that's fine. Not for long. Okay, first fight. Be careful. I did. <laughs> Alright, that's it. First we weaken it, oh, one cool. of them is weakened. We should be able to pacify it. Copy that. Bye bye. We can do that a little bit quicker, but that was decently optimal enough. Okay. Have a look how much rust I get from it. Uh oh, darn it. Okay, one one. Unfortunately, I accidentally interacted with him as well, so that was a little bit of time loss. Like, maybe a second or two. <laughs> so this is where they explain, whoa, there are aerial flow threads in the world. But it also heavy. says we're Seems too heavy to do them currently. And then after the fight here, we pick up the um, an anti-grav chip, which lets us actually be able to do that. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay. What did I tell you? It seems like my attacks are great. Maybe we can both attack Oops. at the same time. Okay. Ready when you are. All set. Ready. Go, go, go! Okay, I'm screwing up a little bit here. On your mark. Now. Okay, that was some time lost there. Who's next? Done and done. That's a shame. Okay, so this segment I basically I basically lost 10 seconds during that. Oh, I, I lost over 10 seconds during this segment. Are you surprised? Yeah, I, I definitely lost over 10 seconds during this segment. Shame. Hmm. Okay, perhaps I just lost. Uh, plus two. <laughs> Fair enough. Over 10 seconds.
Yeah, so this is the part where it says, let's see if we can do the aerial flow threads outside, and they set you in front of an aerial flow thread, which we don't. Oh, sorry, birds. <laughs> we can just didn't see you. leave. <laughs> but we need to do use an aerial flow thread to um, continue, so... But our shoes have the ability to do that now, so... <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm happy that we don't have to do that little aerial flow thread. At least. Cool. Now we actually do the aerial flow thread here, which lets us go to that exit on the right hand side there rather than the one on the left. Okay, that's kind there we are. I feel like a whole new world. He is a whole new world. <laughs> I hope we'll find what we need in this area to repair the nest. Unfortunately, we can't skip the uh even if I go as far as possible to the right hand side, I can't skip the um that. That little cutscene there. I do try, I do try to skip as many cutscenes as I can. Alas, not the case. Hopefully everyone's having a nice Saturday. I have primarily got nothing planned, which is exactly what I wanted to have happen. It's just been a long week, you know. Let's take the yeah. We're taking this flow for it again. Oh, did you feel that? And cutscene. The one section that we can't. Skip and or fast forward. Skip or fast forward. It would be nice if we could fast forward it and skip it. <laughs> skip the fast forward. Yeah, except we do skip the fast forward. <laughs> There's what happens instead. Let me know when you want to lead. All right? Sure will. Okay. This so I'm, I'm holding down. Sweet. I'm getting better at doing that fight. <laughs> that fight is really cool to do quickly, actually. There's a neat timing in that. Huh? What does she want from us? Whew. We lost. Do you see the size of this building? Yeah. It looks like an assembly shop. There were some like that on Truth. Well, in a little better shape, I guess. But I was pretty happy with that segment at least. Glute. Oh wait, yeah. Okay, maybe maybe I'm doing this a little Three, bit slow, but I'm playing two, this safe. One. Now. Good. 
Teamwork. Would rather Teamwork. play that safe. You make a good team. So I'm going that direction. Okay. Definitely. Okay. This this is going to be good. Wow. Nice. I went the wrong. Okay, so there's going the wrong direction a second time. But I did split a little bit later. Can I just kind of... Cool, I can actually kind of just go up there. <laughs> right. That's a little bit quicker, I think. Because <laughs> uh, I am still doing good in terms of picking up all these different components. Sexy cutscene. And turning left, 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 left. If you see anything that seems salvageable for the nest, just scream, okay? Cool, and we're still building up time. Nice. Haven't quite Okay, a little bit of rust here and there. Haven't quite got to the um, Hornet fight yet. That's really where our <laughs> I like to see things happen. Basically. Yeah, the Hornet fight and um, the fight just before vid chat. Maybe I should split that out. Those are the main bits of RNG. Oh, I suppose at the end of um, the anti grab is a little bit of RNG as well. I don't reach. I think I try that every time, but every time I don't reach. <laughs> Smelly socks. I like the way it's color coded hey, there. Place. I like the way that drawing is color coded, so you kind of just obviously know it's hers. She's got the green top on as well. <laughs> yeah, there are you again. Yeah. Good one. Another bit of rust for your collection? Oh, cool. I don't have this one yet. Should we take a closer look? Oh, cool. Uh, I, I missed my button. <laughs> I split late there. Let me know if I can help. So this might be a fake gold. Oh, oh gosh, this this again. Okay, I'm losing time on this segment. To stretch my arm and stuff. What are you doing? Then another the surprise in the verse. Three 
3, 2, 1, we're good. That is me just checking the things there. Okay, so now okay. we're... Oh wait, we're not heading that way because now we have to do the second right. tutorial 20 Let's minutes in. On a few threads to practice. That's it! You did Let's it! Let's do another one! Yay, you can skid! Good job! Now. now you're getting it. Let's see if you can keep it going. Skid! Uh. Skid! Now you have a handle on this. Hey, isn't that oink? And I do wonder if the oink interactions will be faster. I didn't actually check how long it took. My mind just didn't think about it. <laughs> cool. I picked up another piece. I, I know I picked up two, but I was expecting one. Wasn't expecting two. <laughs> it's amusing how the like crude rust, the one, the stuff that is the worst out of the three, is the stuff that is kind of hardest to pick up. Well, it's because we spend seventeen of it early on, right? So we don't really spend the rest of it, much of it, uh, whatever. It is the most common, but not in my route. <laughs> wow, yes in my route. Let's, let's go down here. Let's, let's, let's do this path for a change. Stroll on the water. So who knows if that's quicker. Another one. And it's a shame we can't just be like, oh, this piece of shiny rust, let's use it as crude rust instead. You know? Huh. That would be that too good. Yes. And I I mean, let's just punch this rock a little minute and let's make it non... <laughs> let's make it crude rust. Can we go just a little bit slower? You should take the lead. Set your own pace. No, we cannot go slow. We must go quick. Speed run, speed run, speed run. Okay. Here we go. Oh, that worked out. I never thought we'd make it through. Are you sure? Hey, <laughs> woohoo! We finally got a decent hornet fight. Party in chat. Ah, oh, that's so nice. Okay, now I just need a decent turnip fight. Uh, so when am I gonna do the all bosses version of this run? Uh, you, I hear you ask me. I don't know. Because <laughs> there are bosses in this game, technically. I feel like she's avoiding us. Like, yeah, there there are other creatures you can fight. With the rush mode glitch, I it's not not terrible. You could probably I say glitch. Rush mode basically just means you deal double damage, so it really helps to speed up fights. If you deal, a if you initiate an attack, if it goes off there. Oh, 
Well, the hardest part in this run is halfway through it, right? Unfortunately, also, a lot of the route changes I've made are, like, middle way through. Alright, turn up. Turn up time! Don't do the flop. Don't do the flop. Oh! <laughs> this might be a good time to test the capsules that we put together. First, you'll have to explain to me how they work. It's easy. First, you load up the capsule with flow, then you just need to activate it. Whistle teach him. Let's get it over with. And done. Cool. That's he it. didn't do the flop. Seems We're good. good. Healed. That was easy. Woohoo! Revenger, because you can yeah choose which ending. Yeah, I yeah that that basically how I can what imagine that. For again? Hearts for the nest. Oh yeah, right. Wow. Oh, What's up? wasn't close enough. You won't believe me. What? I just saw Helga pass through the sky just like that. Oh, you don't believe me. Yeah, this is just I'm the sure way you can do this. Something. But I'm guessing what you saw exists, like, in the real world. Hardy har har. <laughs> I mean, the the way I've currently routed it now is, uh, basically, we do one run along the top left hat side of the map, doing all the plot in once, and then picking up the part that you require at the end of the plot. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'll be honest. When when you get to that point, I, I yeah. At, at least you haven't. Um, at least you're not in the same boat as uh, Civ Five speedruns. Another good thing. Yeah, Civ 5 speedruns. Am I right? <laughs> it takes longer loading into the game than it does to actually do the speedrun of it. Or well, the quicker speedrun of it, I should say. Because the quicker speedrun is uh, you sell your city and then press end turn, and time ends on end turn, so. <laughs> Let's not have that glitch happen to me, please, if that's okay. Yeah. So, cutscene. Good. Good. We got the cutscene. Then we can chill here until the second cutscene happens. I'm starting to get real hungry here. You? Oh no. Nice, 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 nice. I mean, I can't deny the game you're talking about does sound like something I would at least, oh gosh, try out casually. Like, it's definitely something I'm gonna go look up afterwards. It, it's basically my sort of thing. And I enjoyed Yoku's Island Express a lunch, so <laughs> you got you got a good track record for other games I enjoy that you play.
But we'll see, we'll see. There's a difference between a game I want to speedrun and a game I want to uh, enjoy. These days, at least. We've gone past the major RNG points of the run. It's just if I screw up on menuing for teleporting, that can be a time loss. If I accidentally encounter someone, that could be time loss. I've remembered to hold the button down here, so Slam! haven't lost time with that. <laughs> Let's see if I get uh, that's a door skip. Hey, I got that's a door skip. Oh, it makes me happy every time I do the run of this. I really love, like, kinda non-important uh, second skipping, uh, like, skipping a uh, cutscene that's like a second long. <laughs> Still going well, still going well. I, saw I had to readjust myself a little bit there, so maybe... I should really not have that as a split anymore. It used to be different, that's why. Okay, hyper propellers, we're heading right. Perfect. We just need a little rust to hold it all together now. I'm getting closer, I'm getting closer, I'm more intense. <laughs> Hold my hand, will you? Thank you. Follow me. <laughs> okay. And you can play this game co-op as well. But I think that would just, like, playing co-op in this game would lose a bunch of time since you can't uh, fast forward through the text boxes nearly as quickly. This is both players. Oh, basically both of you would have to mash. And the mashing would have to basically be in time. In order for that to work out well. I think we found a shortcut. And the co-op in this basically means you can just also wander around, so it would be easier to pick up other stuff. But that's not hugely needed anyway. Fair enough. Well, I, I, I'm glad you're enjoying bingos and stuff like that. I uh, bet Bingothon's pretty happy with that. <laughs> uh -huh. uh, when are they doing Bingothon again next? I, I just really don't care for um, online marathons anymore. I, I'm I'm done okay, with them now basically. I'm really starving. Imagine how I feel. <sighs> K. 
Okay. Okay. Let's get to work. Yeah, I did a darkest dungeon run there. Yeah, I think that's the only thing I've really actually done bingos for. I made a bingo for XCOM 2, but never followed that through. Never actually, um... Because I think that would work quite well in XCOM 2, but... Because we did think of over 25 goals. 30. I think 34, 35. So that was plenty enough. Less so much for variety, but like plenty enough for playing. Um, but me and Zonaris never actually went through with that. Maybe we should at one point. Who knows? That, that's what I mean, yeah. It shouldn't be much longer. Like, 25 is minimum, right? So? Oh. Okay. I, I've done that slowly. Are you sticking around? We might want to go back to where we came from. Yeah, like I did that slowly, purely so I didn't l lose 30 seconds. <laughs> you know, let, let's lose 5 to not lose 30. I'm okay with that. Two and a half. <laughs> okay, now uh, we're still teleporting. We're still teleporting. So remember to go up four times. Thing? Give me a minute. Come on. Where is it? Over there. Cool. And we're going here. Okay, okay. Let's just have this segment go okay. <laughs> and then we'll find out. good pace here. Which makes me happy. Makes me real happy. If this is a decent PB, I might call it this... this... Uh, uh, this might be my last. Since, you know... Uh, oh, I didn't trigger that cutscene. I was worried about it. <laughs> that came down nearby. Cool, that was done well. Fragment away tops. I remember to actually <laughs> do the movement for that there. Need to be careful I was thinking, to, sure. thinking about it to myself uh, beforehand. Not fair. The Omni Impact might even things out. 
Here we go! Done and done. That's how we rock. Perfect. Lovely. Lovely. Let's go through some terrain. Come on. Mashing as hard as I can. I really want that good time. <laughs> really want that good time. So therefore I will play it safe on the ending. Nekatai. Nekatai. Don't be scared. We're just trying to take a closer look at you. Good. I was worried like that would actually play out the um eating animation there. Because <laughs> those can eat flow threads. It doesn't save lose time in terms of uh, it, it's an animation that has to play. And then we have to stop and look at it and be like, whoa, is that a thing eating a flow thread? Um, that's all that happens with it. Three forty. Three forty. That's roughly when I entered here. What? Whoa. I got stuck behind a rock. <laughs> Otherwise, that was a cool um, different path. And it also means I just don't have to... Wow, I don't know if it's more direct. That's the thing. So, 340. So twenty, a minute twenty, that uh, getting the hyper rust there takes. I think the oint cutscenes will take more than a minute twenty. Of one just trying to find him. I have no clue where he spawns. Maybe it's a guaranteed space each time. If it's a guaranteed space each time, that'll be a little bit easier to do. But, I don't know. I don't know. I generally haven't um, tried it. I think this has been an okay segment so far. Not been mind-blowing in any shape or form, but... This segment doesn't need to be mind-breaking. Uh, it is quite a long segment. Maybe I should cut it in half somewhere. Do you still need rest? Of course. It's always useful. It's always useful. Oh gosh. That almost sent me through it, flowing off. Don't get found by Monsieur. Cool. Right. There's still more. Oh. Great. Great. <laughs> Just need to get to work.
cool. Pardon if I made any weird faces there. Mashing is long. <laughs> Especially since it's uh, not just straight mashing as well. Um, thank god. Cool. Mashing can rest for a little while. A little bit. I say that and then that happens. But. Here's be good. Cool. That was basically instantly. was basically instantly. Heck yeah. Oof. Okay. There's still some... Oh, I... Yeah, sure. Okay, I was still able to take that cutscene. Take that uh, shortcut. But now, all I need to do is play it safe. So we'll have to do it little by little. Another one. This one's for me. I am taking this slow, steady, and successfully. We are not losing two minutes here. We are not losing two minutes here. Are you sure you don't want to stop? I can do it alone. No we way. are not losing two minutes here. <laughs> we are like doing we're well. Let's hope it's not just a feeling. I have a feeling ooh, that tonight I'm not going to read chat and then get distracted and accidentally fall off the cliff here. I think that's how that line went. <laughs> the gloves are overheating. Be careful not to burn your hands. <laughs> you know, at this point in time. Like I know it's I know the direction to head is fine. Uh but I would just really rather not accidentally screw this bit up. Cool. And nice. I actually got a sub 49. <laughs> Yeah! Good run is good. Good run is good. I am happy. Happiness is good. Great days. Alright. Good job, everyone. Let's, uh. Let's, um, stop recording.